somebody said the other day, you know, every time I turn around, you got a man. Well, bitch, stop turning around. I can't fuck a lame nigga, put some diamonds on your teeth so you can give me brain nigga Count a check and fuck me next, I'm hanging with the same niggas You can't even handle bitches, we are not the same nigga <sighs> Okay, what's up you guys, welcome to Dreamland We do not day dream, we slay dream It is I the Dream King Dreams all back again for another video I know, I know, I know, I know I have been missing in action, and I'm extremely, extremely sorry about it, but that is why I'm here today. As you can see, I'm extremely dusty, and I have a lot of dry spots on my face. Um, so, this is what I'm going to be doing today. I'm going to be cleaning my face and explaining to y'all where I have been, what has been going on, and what is to come. So... Before we get into all of that, before we do anything else, make sure you go ahead and hit that subscribe button, give me a big, big thumbs up, and I'm still sleeping. <laughs> what else I tell y'all do? Oh, go ahead and hit that notification button. You don't want to miss anything that is going to be coming up on my channel. Do everything I just said, and we're going to pop, lock, and drop it into the video. Okay. So, basically, as you know, I made a video saying that I was going to be uploading every five days. Every five days is a little too long. I'm going to try to update every three days again, like when I started YouTube. But I don't know how that's going to work. Oh, my head is itching. I don't know exactly how that's going to work, so don't hold me to that but yeah i don't know how this is gonna go because being that i work and i'm about to start working two jobs i don't know how this is gonna work but i'm pretty sure it's doable um the reason why i have not even recorded anything yet is because i am in the process well i'm not in the process of moving i have moved and so i don't really I haven't got adjusted to where, you know, I know the proper setup to, you know, sit down and record. That's why I'm doing this video right here to kind of talk to y'all, tell y'all to bear with me. Because I know some of y'all get a little impatient. Because I know some of y'all get a little impatient. And y'all just be wanting videos and the videos and videos. I don't be wanting to put out videos. I bitch, I be wanting to get y'all content. It's the difference between giving you videos and giving you content. I be trying to give y'all content, okay? Um, so, yeah. Do I have to wash my hair? Mm. I'm gonna wash my hair and I'm gonna be right back. Six and a half hours later. Now that I got that out the way, I can do my face. So anyway, yeah, let me just stop rambling and just get on the video because I know y'all ain't here for all that extra shit. So basically, yeah, I have moved and I don't really have like the extra space to like do anything. My apartment ain't small, but um, I like my setup kind of extra and I just don't have that kind of extra. I don't have that kind of extra room to be extra, okay? I am officially moved. I know I, ma I mentioned in the video that I was in the process of moving, but I've been here about a week and a half now, so that's about how long it's been. Probably longer than since I recorded. The video that I posted was already pre-recorded, so yeah, I've been kind of cheating y'all just a little bit. Sorry. Um, but yeah, we're going to start off with the Pure Clay Mask. Agro Pure by L'Oreal. Y'all know I love L'Oreal. Yeah, L'Oreal is probably one of my favorite makeup brands. That's drugstore. But yeah, we're just gonna put this on. And this is the same one that I used in the last one, so it's nothing. I didn't buy nothing new. This is my my average. This is my everyday mask. Well, not everyday, but this is the mask that I use the most. But yeah, so I've moved. I like it here. It's kind of different being out of my mom and daddy house. Um, so that's going to take some time getting used to again. Because, you know, I was out on my own years ago. And that was damn near four years ago. So, 
it's gonna take some time getting used to again, but yeah, it ain't taking that much time to get used to, but you know, you, you being used to seeing them every day, now I live like 30 miles away from them, maybe. Maybe a little more. So I'm not like, it's not like I'm even up the street. Like, I'm just like, have to drive 30 miles to go see them. So, like I said, that's gonna take some time to get used to. I talk to them every day though. My mama, she try to act like she don't miss me, but I know she do, cause she be calling me about dumb shit. Like the other day she called me and asked me that I know how to cook a hamburger. I'm like, um, yeah. And it was like the hamburger that's already done. I'm like, you put it on the skillet. Oh, well, I didn't think you knew how to do it. What? So. My daddy, everybody know me and my daddy is like best friends. So, of course, he missed me. And he said that it's taking some time for him to get adjusted. Because the house is quiet and my baby ain't there. I'm not there. So, yes. So, I have moved. I would give a empty apartment tour, but I ain't shit empty about the apartment. So, you can't do that. The house is already full. Ain't nothing left out. Maybe you can see his towels in the back. Um, Let's see what else is new. Oh, my setup. So my setup is gonna be in my bedroom. I just have to get everything situated. Um, once I get everything situated, then I will get back recording, which after I upload this video, I'm probably gonna record a video like with my makeup, makeup and stuff on. But um, yeah, so after that, after this video, I'll probably record like a video with my makeup on and stuff, or I might record tomorrow, it just depends. I'm off today and tomorrow. And I've been waiting all day for Sephora to call me. Um, I put in an application in Sephora after I got off of Indeed. I got on like Indeed.com and Sephora had just posted that they need a sales associate like 10 minutes after I got on. I got right on it. I called, I put in the application. She gave, basically gave me an over the phone interview and was like, she needed me to put in the application at JCPenney's too, cause I, it gotta be in two systems. So I put it in, I've been waiting on her to call me, which I probably call her tomorrow cause she has not called me and I think they closed at like nine. But I'm gonna get her a little time and I'm going to call tomorrow cause I need uh, not only a second job, but I've been wanting to work at Sephora forever. Um, so yeah, hopefully that works out in my favor. Um, If that works out, then I have two jobs, so I, I've kind of been on somewhat of a, a weird schedule recording. But, you know, all is well, ends well. Um, so it's like a lot of stuff that's been going on. I had a good Christmas. My Christmas was okay up until I got sick, which, when I tell you, I threw the fuck down. Like, I threw the fuck down okay i look ashy now they let you know it's working i threw that out i had chitlins that was my first thing on christmas i had chitlins then i turned around i had some ham i had some dressing i had some fish i had lasagna broccoli casserole banana pudding and next thing you know by the time i made it back home and i was time me to go to work i had a fucking stomach virus so I was shitting and throwing up everywhere. I got to work shitting and throwing up everywhere. Like I was just like in full blown virus mode. I couldn't hold my shit in, couldn't hold my throw up in, I couldn't eat, I couldn't drink, I couldn't do shit. I felt like a human fucking volcano. My asshole was burning by the time I got off from work. I had shitted so much, my ass was raw. My Christmas was kind of shitty, okay? But I did eat everything I wanted to eat, so I can't complain. I got to see another Christmas. Everybody got what they wanted. I got a new apartment. My baby got everything that she wanted. So boom, that was all we needed, okay? So everything else was pretty good. 
Today is the 29th, or if it's not the 29th, yeah, I think today is the 29th. Today is my one year anniversary for YouTube. I'm trying to do a video um, of like running down the stuff that I did over the year. Um, Okay, sorry, I thought I heard another phone ringing. So, uh, yeah, what was I talking about? Oh, I was talking about my year, one year anniversary. So I was trying to do a video for that, but obviously I did not have the space to do it. And now that I think I have the space that I need to do it, I'm gonna try to like run it down or whatever and see what I'll, see what I, what kind of video I can put together. Basically saying, you know, thank y'all for sticking with me a year. Some of y'all been here since day one. Some of y'all been here since day 39. Some of y'all been here since month six, you know. Thank everybody. I just want to thank every single body for supporting me. And I love y'all so much. Y'all the real life dream team. Like for real, that is not just a name. Y'all the real life dream team. Y'all that stuck with me when I left and came back, left and came back. I did name changes and all this stuff. And I really, 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 really do thank y'all. So next up on my list is my love life. I know when I did my Q&A, people asked me, um, basically, when was I going to get a man? Could we play games on, um, on YouTube? And I said yes when I got one, that I would. Well, sis. I got one now and he is very much on board with being on YouTube because he just likes to be on the camera for some reason. I've been knowing him and we'll probably do like another video explaining how we met, but I've been knowing him about five years. I've met him before I met Mr. Bloody Man. Uh, Y'all know who Mr. Bloody Man is by now. If not, I try to put a video in the in a car up here if I can remember. But I was knowing him, I've been knowing him before then. Me and him tried to talk, but it didn't really work out. So, by me working at Walmart and everybody see me, yeah, I kind of kicked off like that. We just kind of got the reminiscing and it went from there. But he's very much on board with uh, being on camera. So he said that he would, he would like that. So be looking forward to that. I don't know how quick it's gonna come, but you know, be looking forward to that. But yes, I do have a man now. I know somebody said the other day, you know, every time I turn around, you got a man. Well, bitch, stop turning around. So let me wash this off my face. My face is barely moving. So we got that out of the way. I about need to go check on my food before I burn my apartment down. Yeah, I was almost homeless and so was everybody else in the complex because the damn pot was damn near drying on fire. So anyway, yeah, I'm not cooking no more no time soon. So yeah. Anywho, um, but yeah, he's definitely on board with that. Um, he is not here right now. He should be here in a minute. So he might sneak on camera, he might not. I don't know, I guess it depends on how he feel. But okay, now that my face is smooth as a baby's bottom, I'm going to go in with my new favorite product, Witch Hazel. I love, 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 love Witch Hazel. I just, I just got on Witch Hazel probably about a month ago. And I would see it. And it smells like barbecue sauce to me. And I know that's kind of like, it's kind of a fat thing. Um, but yeah, I love the smell. If you don't get me wrong, it just smell like barbecue sauce to me. Sweet Baby Ray barbecue sauce. And I'm here for it. So, you know, if I got to walk around smelling like, you know, barbecue sauce with my face smooth, then that's fine. But I love the smell of it. Yeah, it smells good. But it's been keeping my face so smooth and less problematic. Um, it's, I use, I got two bottles, and the other one is to take off makeup and clean brushes.
Don't try to steal my show. Back out while you can. They can't see you. You gonna close the door? They still can't see you. Anyway, that's that for that. I don't know if anybody even noticed, but I don't have no chin in there. So I feel like a squirrel. And I've had it so long and it's gone and my face feels so naked. But anyway, yeah, the witch hazel works miracles for face and body. Oily, irritated, I got oily skin, irritated, red, damaged, blemished, or inflamed skin. It helps for everything. Uh, a lot of people that put it on dry, I don't. I love my coconut oil. I don't even know if I used it last time, but I put my coconut oil on top. Coconut oil. I put my coconut oil on top of it so it don't dry my face out. Too bad. And yeah, so. Myself. Okay, yeah, don't talk trying to put shit on your face. But it bring my skin back to life. My skin is so smooth right now. And that's all for my face. Is there anything else I need to talk about? That's pretty much it. I just want to keep y'all updated to let y'all know that I have not forgotten about y'all. I'm not quitting YouTube. I'm still very much on YouTube. Just moving, just taking a toll on my body. And then, of course, other things that come with moving and trying to pay bills, this, that. And the third, shit happens. And you have to get adjusted. I'm sure everybody on YouTube took a break once upon a time. I just don't want y'all to disappear on me because I know how quick y'all drop off when people don't upload. And I've been getting emails and text messages telling me that I need to get my ass back on her because uh, my spaces are going from five days to six or seven. But it's really not on purpose. I'm not tired of YouTube. I'm not bored with YouTube. It's just I hadn't had time to do anything in front of the camera. I hadn't had any time to even play my makeup. So yeah, so I will be doing it either today or tomorrow because I'm off today and tomorrow. And I might even try to go live in between here. I don't know exactly when this video will be up, but I am gonna try to put the video up really, 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 really soon. Uh, I just use 360 style wave control. It's damn near gone. Like I'm scraping a bowl with a fork. Um, Everything is just too much right now. So once I get everything situated and everything is back to where I need it, y'all will know it. I will be trying to record all the time um, back to where I was when I was back at home, my mom and daddy. This is a lot of body, boo. A lot of body. Y'all know I love my lot of body if you watched the last video. Um, so yeah. Oh, and that's it for that. Put my do rag on. But yes, that's it. Just, I wanted to kind of keep y'all updated. I know this video was all over the place, but I didn't want to just come and talk straight into the camera. I had to do something. But yes, be expect the videos really, really soon. And yeah. So, I hope you guys enjoyed that talk through or whatever you want to call it. I hope it wasn't too boring. It really wasn't no video, video, video. It was more or less uh, me just telling y'all what's been going on with me. So yeah, if you like that video, any of my other videos, only thing I can tell you is binge watch my other videos until I can come completely back. I'm sorry, but yeah. Uh, just binge watch my other videos. I put a link, uh, I put the, put a little end notation, a little end videos and stuff. Uh, for you to watch at the end of the video. I hope y'all hit that subscribe button. I hope y'all give me a big, big thumbs up. And I hope y'all hit that notification bell. That way you do not miss another video. <sighs> Thank y'all for hanging in there with me. 
Today is my one year anniversary on YouTube. I appreciate everything y'all have done for me. And I'm sorry about this break again. I love y'all so much. And I will see you bitches in the next video, which I hope will be in about the next two or three days. So, bye.